cashless economy. Obaseki backs Buhari's regime's policy, says is the best. The Edo State Governor, Governor Godwin Obaseki, has said that as a government, we do not have a problem with the policy and ask that the policy be encouraged. Well, the people also do not have any problems with the policy. The problems that the Nigerian people have is the implementation of the policy. Now, the Nigerian people do not fault the CBN or fault the presidency for actually trying to redesign the Naira. Now, the reasons which the CBN did give to Nigerians um, for the redesign of the Naira is actually good enough to, for them. The problem that Nigerians are facing right now is the implementation of the policy. How are um, the federal government and the CBN as a body going about the implementation of this um, policy? Now, you do not just jump into becoming a cashless um, economy um, just by the twinkle of an eye. It has to take process, especially for a nation where the people have already used to um, being, having a lot of cash inflow and using cash for all forms of payments and all. You don't just switch it like you turn off and turn on a light switch. It's supposed to be a gradual process and um, a very slow process for the people to be able to get into it and get used to it. Uh, aside the implementation of the policy is the fact that the, the CBN doesn't seem to be prepared for this policy that it wants to implement. Now we're trying to make it a cashless society and yet Nigerians still cannot get the um, availability of the new Naira notes at hand. Well, we're going to go into the details of today's report now. But before we do that, we'd like to say a very big welcome to each and every one of you. If you're joining us for the very first time, please do well to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Now, to all of our existing subscribers, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up on our post as they come your way thank you and god bless you now into the details in full governor godwin obaseki of edo state on monday called on nigerians to support the president muhammad buhari regime's cashless policy describing it as the best for the banking sector now, Mr. Obaseki made the call shortly after a closed door meeting with officials of the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, and senior management of banks in Benin City, the state's capital. The governor noted that the meeting was called due to his concern over the scarcity of cash and the hardship the people were going through while trying to get cash. As a government, we do not have a problem with the policy. The policy should be encouraged. It is the best for our banking system. However, we want to ensure that we do this as painlessly and as seamlessly as possible. He taxed Nigerians on making payment via Android phones rather than visiting banks. Others with less sophisticated phones can still make payment with the USSD code given to them by their banks, he said. Now, Mr. Godwin Obaseki explained that there were also companies that offer electronic wallet services registered by the CBN. We also have POS terminals that have been licensed to operate through which the people can also make payments, he added. Now, he noted that his administration 
will join hands with the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, and the Banker Committee in the state to monitor the situation and resolve the problems. Now, also speaking, Blaise Ijebo, a CBN director, urged the people to use alternative means to make payments, adding that the Central Bank of Nigeria wanted to drive a cash light economy for the benefit of Nigerians. We are going to make sure that there is cash supply within the next few days. We have asked banks to pay up to 20,000 Naira, but because of the crowd, some banks might not be able to pay 20,000 Naira at once. So if they can pay you 5,000 or 10,000, use that to manage for the next day or two. We are going to make supply available, he said. Mr. Ijebo stated that the Apex Bank had set up a monitoring team working with the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, and the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offenses Commission, ICPC. Well, that is it on the details of today's report. And uh, we can see Governor Godwin Obaseki of Edo State actually um, encouraging Nigerians to uh, encourage and go in line with um, the cashless economy and cashless um, policy, which the CBN and the presidency um, are trying to put into place, saying that it's actually a good one for our nation, Nigeria, and it's something that will be of great um, use and help to the Nigerian people. And we see that um, Obaseki also can... Um, attest to the fact that Nigerians are actually going through a hard time of hardship, not being able to get physical cash for their various day-to-day uh, -day activities, for the various needs that they need to undergo um, each day. And we see that he did have a meeting um, with the CBN officials there in um, Benin City. And we do hope that um, the CBN will be able to do something um, quite tangible to actually help alleviate the hardship and the sufferings that um, Nigerians are undergoing right now due to the scarcity of uh, the Naira notes. Well, that's all we can take on the details of today's report. Until we'll come your way next time with more news happenings, please do well to stay safe. Bye-bye.